Within X3, we have the concept of favorites, uh, just like you would in a uh, web browser. Uh, to have your, if to look at your favorites list, um, you kind of have this favorites toolbar uh, coming across the top of the screen here. And, you know, on this toolbar, I can basically click on any of these links and that's going to tunnel me into the respective function, whether it be a general ledger account, an import function, um, you know, a product site record, and so forth. Um, in addition to that, um, what you'll see is you have uh, the ability here to kind of see, um, you know, these bookmarks here kind of in the drop down list. So, you know, within here, I can kind of manage these if I wanted to. The stock manager here, if I wanted to remove that, I could click on my delete there. And it kind of gives you a confirmation message. I can say yes to that. Uh, here, uh, you know, I can add separation. So if I wanted to kind of organize my uh, bookmarks, I could, you know, add a line through there. If I wanted to change the description here, I can click on the edit. So maybe I don't want to call that just accounts, but maybe like GL accounts. Okay, I have the ability to do that. Um, so as it relates uh, to these uh, bookmarks or these favorites here, um, to add and remove favorites, um, it's easy. You know, I can just, for instance, if I wanted to add the sales quotes up here to my favorites list, I can just come down and hover over top of the quotes uh, function. Then I'll see that white star to the right of it. I can just go ahead and give that a left click. Then that adds it up as a bookmark for me. Okay. If I want to remove it, I can just come down here, click on it again. Then that takes it away uh, from my favorites list.